Venezuela are still trying to find the mother of Pirates catcher Elias. The team is offering their support. Megan Schiller explains why kidnappings of celebrities' relatives are a common occurrence in Venezuela. Right now, everyone on social media is talking about how Diaz should be able to be focused on spring training, but instead, he's likely worried sick about the safety of his mother. A quick scroll through Elias Diaz's Instagram shows many photos of him and his 72 year old mother, Ana Soto, kidnapped in Venezuela late. Diaz captions his photo saying his mother is his number one, whom he loves with his whole heart. Venezuelan media broke the news Thursday. A reporter tweeted that someone kidnapped Diaz's mother in San Francisco, a town eight hours outside of the capital city of Caracas. The president of the Pirates later released this statement saying, quote, We are all shocked and deeply concerned for Elias's mother, as well as for Elias and his entire family. We are using all of the resources available at the Pirates and Major League Baseball to support Elias and his family during this incredibly difficult time. As we work with authorities on his mom's safe return, we will withhold further comment. We talked with a former Venezuelan citizen who says kidnapping in general runs rampant. A few guys grab you, put it in a car, tour around the city looking for ATMs, grab your credit cards, your debit cards, check in on everyone. You have to give your, mm -hmm. your password. And express kidnapping is now a livelihood for the most notorious criminals in the country. Plus, this isn't the first reported kidnapping involving a professional baseball player's family member in Venezuela. They knew who she was. Mm -hmm. And so they kidnap her, and they hoping that Elias will jump and pay what they're asking. Reporting at PNC Park, Megan Schiller, KDKA TV News.